Good morning, everybody. Nate from Cape Cod Magnet Crew. Got a new camera, hoping that it's gonna cut down on some of the muffled sounds that we get on the other one. Let me know if the sound changed, if it sounds better to you. I am down here at Crab Creek today. Last time I was here, I had to go in after the Helios, but I was able to save it. Today I've got something a little bit better with the Athena, and we're gonna see if it does better on the rocks. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Got a lot of cool videos coming up. See you on the other side. It's not usual that the water's running towards me here at uh, Crab Creek, but let's see what Athena can get me at this place. Feels like we actually got something big here, folks. Yeah, we got something. What is it? Oh, no. Is that a bike? What is that? Oh, let's see what it is here. Here we got part of it. That's so weird. It's not even a... Oh. You know what it is? It's like a grabby thing. Grabby, grabby. Does it even work? Nah, it's frozen. That stinks. Whatever, that's cool though. Neato! <clears throat> that's pretty fun. I like that. Never got some grabbers before. The Athena's just grabbing the grabbers. Yeah. Um, you know what? I'm not sure if that's a weight or if it's our first bullet. I think it's a bullet. I'm gonna have to clean it up and see. Then a fishing hook. Sweet. When these things come off after a while, they all just like tape up the ropes. What do you do? I try to keep them for as long as I can, but they don't stick around too much. Leaves held on by fishing hook, tiny, tiny guy. Let's see, see, that's what felt like something was going through, but no, did grab a giant hook. Yeah, I don't think they're bullets. I think they're weights, because there's another one right there. That's the danger zone, people. That's kind of where I was trying to stay away from. That was where the Helios was lost. Again, it was found, but I went in. And that wasn't more than a couple months ago. That water was chilly to the bone. It's even worse now, I bet. When y'all lose a magnet, do you stay away from that location? Or do you keep going back hoping that maybe not only you grab your magnet, but that you get the treasures that you were looking for in the first place? I don't know, man. I haven't come back here since. So I'm fearful of losing this guy. Whew. See, those scare the bejesus out of me, those rocks. That's what I'm afraid of. Luckily, that's really, really close. But that's exactly what I'm afraid of by using this guy. See? I saved it. Luckily. I forgot my bucket. You still gotta clean up, people. Luckily, Donald Yarmouth has left that trash container. We're gonna go, uh, might try to grab a couple pops another spot that I know is good, so we'll talk soon.
you know, we've come down here a bunch of times. I don't think I've ever gotten this one on uh, on film yet. But when we first started, we caught lots of stuff down here. And I told the kids a story that right about over there, when I was a little kid, we were walking, I fell into like this little weird mud hole. Parents were able to get me out and stuff, but I was missing a shoe. So somewhere under there is my shoe. Eh, looks like we actually might have gotten a couple pieces of something. Some schmutz. Let's see. So first off we got rocks, which are nothing. One little piece of metal here. Put that down there. Rocks, rocks, rocks. Now that's definitely something cruddy. Got a hook. All these people driving by must think I'm crazy. It's freezing out here. You'll never catch my kids out here though, so. Even though it's the Cape Cod Magnet crew, in the winters it's Cape Cod Magnet Nate. All right guys, we got some weight on here. And it looks like some something's actually on here. So, yeah, we got a couple pieces of something. Some sort of, oh yeah, it's a piece of a trap. There's lots of crab traps here. We've caught those tons of times. Just a stick, but then that's a, oh, you know what? If I bang that out, that's a knife handle, I can tell. Because it's not super, super metallic, the knife inside of the handle. It's not super magnetic, but uh, the knife that's inside the handle, it clicks right on. Wire. piece of wire. Nothing on there but rocks and schmutz. Do get a big piece of something. That, again, it's another part of a trap, I think. It's another little metal piece of bar of some sort. Feels like we're dragging. I know we got something this time, folks. Oh yeah, oh god, it's covered in that orange yucky junk. Oh man, looks like a brain. It's a brain! What's that? What is it? Let's get this off. And we'll see, I mean, let's get this orange stuff off here. Yeah. It's definitely some sort of algae or something. Oh, you know what it is? It's a flashlight. You know, I'm kind of surprised we haven't caught many of those yet. But there we go. Flashlight. Yeah, the cool thing about that flashlight is I bet there's batteries in it. And those sure as heck don't belong in the water. I do get some stuff on here. It looks like just a nail or something. It's a lure. A lure of some sort. Just lure. Got another hook. I think I felt some click in here, folks. We have something. This is doing that weird wobble. So, let's see. Are we pulling something? Uh, I don't know. There's a lot of schmutz on it, but... Definitely a chunk of something. Oh, you know what it is? It's a bolt. It's not a bolt. It's a nut. <laughs> yep. Just a nut. Tagging. There you go, Mark. We're tagging. I think we got something. Okay, y'all. Definitely got something. Remember I was talking earlier about traps. We catch these all the time when we've been down here, and that hasn't been a lot. It's always these rings. They're part of a crab trap, I think. At least that's what I've been told. Then uh, it's just another magnetic rock. Oh, 
All right, we got something weighty here, folks. Oh, I don't know. It's not super, super weighty, but it's definitely something that doesn't belong in there. Um, I have absolutely no idea, you know? That is just crud galore. We'll smash it with the hammer when we get back to the car. Let's see what it is. Got another wire. Another wire. You know, nothing here is exciting today, but it's a good cleanup. We clicked. Clicked pretty good too. It's just more of those metal, it's just more of those metal pieces. Another tiny little metal piece. All right, we got hit on the way in here, so something on there. Uh, not sure what because it's covered in crud. But it's not even really, really metallic, so I don't know what it is. Whatever it is, again, doesn't belong there. Get it out of there. We're gonna go right along the edge here and see what happens. Oh, that's a big tag right over there. Big one. Ooh. Wouldn't mind if you came with me. Wouldn't mind if you got out of that water. Get out. Got no time for you being in this water. Let's go, it's taking you so long. Oh yeah, we're definitely on something. It doesn't look like much. It's just kind of schmutzy. Yeah, it's just a rock. Tiny little wire. That's all right. We'll take that. Get it out of there. Oop. Screw. Tiny little ouchie. A whole bunch of garbage again. Kind of where we're, where we're at today. Just tiny pieces, rocks, and bolts. Yeah, see, just tiny pieces like that. See that last one? If you hit something big, we stay. If you don't, we go. Yeah, that's it. There's not much left here. Another piece, of, a bunch of pieces of ouchie. Got one here, here, here. I'm gonna clean this magnet up, but I think we got a good clean out today. So we'll catch you on the outro. Hey guys, we just took off from uh, the other spot. Like I said, this is just a test. I wanted to see how this camera worked out. Um, yeah, so let me know in the comments what you think. Did the sound sound better? Did the picture look crisper? And uh, I'm gonna take off for home. See you guys soon. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't, and uh, see you next time.